What's up everyone? How are you? And namis ko talaga mag-vlog dito and hindi bago pa kaya kasi nag-change na ako ng arrangement dito sa condo kasi mayroon akong bagong gagawin dito sa whole condo and may additional and may changes din siya. So, kaka-facial ko lang yesterday and guys, ang ganda ng skin ko na. So guys, kahapon, nagpa-facial ako and day before no, naglaro ako ng badminton. Naka-10 sets ata kami. So, more than ilang games yun. Mga 5 games. Basta, more than 10 sets talaga guys and super intense ang laro namin. After 6 months or more than 6 months, pa ako bumalik ng maglaro ng badminton. So, nagulat talaga yung katawan ko. So, sore talaga yung whole body ko and pagod na pagod yung feeling ko. So, before ako nagpa-facial, nag-errands ako. Guys, nakatulog ako na nagpa-facial. Inatok na talaga ako na nag-extract siya sa ilong ko. Biglang after ng ilong ko, hindi ko na maalala kung saan yung mga ibang mga prick niya. Di ba pag nag-papa-extract ka sa flawless, may cotton pads na nilalagay sa mata mo. So, di niya alam if nakapikit ka or naka... Ano. Hindi halata if nakatulog ka ba or hindi. So, yung guys, biglang sabi ako ng... Ah! Tapos biglang... God, ano gagawin ko next? Bakla, ang lakas talaga ng sigaw ko kasi parang may na-dream ako na nahulog ata ako. So, apat lang yung bed sa SM Makati and tabi-tabi talaga kami and full yung day na yun. Biglang sinabi ko lang kay ate, ah, oh, ate, ang sakit. <laughs> sabi ko na lang, ang sakit kasi nahiya talaga ako. Sabi lang ni ate, Sir, parang sa ilong ata, ah, nakaya mo pero dito sa cheeks, hindi. Totoo naman, mas masakit talaga sa ilong kaysa sa cheeks. Pero... Pero yun yun guys, maganda naman yung skin ko now, so yun na yung important. And also guys, nagpa-shape and scalp ako. Ang ganda niya, tinan niyo guys. Super liit ng leg ko ngayon, kasi nagpa-shape and scalp ako dito sa chin. Pwede din siya sa abs, pero always ako nagpa-shape and scalp sa chin talaga. Pag for example, feeling ko bloated na ako, hindi, hindi na kaya ng workout, or hindi na kaya ng anong massage-massage dito. Ayun yung ginawa ko, and guys, tinan niyo, oh, pag taas, mas payat pa. Mas na-form yung jawline ko, mas kita siya. And, and So guys, if you wanna try it, just go to Flawless And if may event kayo, may mga wedding kayo na atinan Or ikakasal ka, or may birthday ka, magdebuka ka Pero feeling mo bloated ka pa rin And gusto mo may, at least man lang ma-form yung dito sa leg Kasi yun yung mas focus sa photos And yun, instant jawline mm. Mm 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 Hey guys, so andito na ako sa BJC and andito yung building ni Doc sa RCBC and tapat niya is yung The Fort at BJC. RCBC building siya, so papasok na tayo. So, akit lang tayo dito sa second floor. Guys, hindi na ako marunong mag-vlog. Inihiya na talaga ako mag-vlog. Ayan, blur na ako. And uh, guys, pag akit lang talaga sa stairs, makikita niyo agad yung dental studio. Ayan, sila Doc. Hi! Good afternoon. So it's 2.16 and 2.30 yung appointment ko. So ayun man tayo guys. Guys, hindi talaga ako marunong mag-vlog. As in kanina naglalakad ako parang pag-anan ako. Nahiyan na talaga ako. Ayan, Christmas pa rin sa kanila dito. Hi, dog! I'm good. Say hi to the vlog! Hi! I'm good, kamusta? <laughs> so, si Doc Yara is always nandito pag nandito ako. <laughs> Guys, ito yung mark kahapon sa breaking. And yun lang siya nakita. Ang ganda dito kasi super welcoming talaga yung first step ko dito ever. Kala ko like, alam mo yun, di ba may mga, mga dental clinic talaga na super intimidating and natakot ka and parang alam mo yun, super professional yun lahat na parang Okay, dito parang fans mo natin. Nakakabeso ko nga yung mga doctors dito. Hi, Doc! Hi! Kamusta na? Kamusta po? You're in the vlog. <laughs> Good to see you po. Welcome, welcome, welcome! Okay, we're here inside. Thank you. Good afternoon po. Yung treatment na gagawin ko. Anong tawag lang? Okay, like yung gagawin niya ay cosmetic bonding. Yun lang yung gagawin sa akin. Wala siyang shaving talaga. Mag-a-add lang. Kasi hindi pantay yung nipin ka. Yeah, everything well, everything is straight, mm -hmm. but there's only one tooth that we want to align. So instead of treating it completely with braces, you having to go through the hassle, oh, yeah. we'll just do a direct cosmetic bonding. So yeah. you'll see the results after one hour. One, two hours. Because I've braces now before, guys. And I don't want to mag braces. I said to So, that's what I'm going to do. So excited, guys. Because this is the side. Na to. And pag you smile, ako, always yung angle ko dito. Ayan, yan. Kasi parang full. Malalaki yung teeth ko dito ng side. And then dito, maliliit. Nag-braces ako dati, di ba? Pero hindi ko na, hindi ako nag-retainers after. So hindi ko siya na-maintain. So umikot a little ang isa dito. 
Pero okay na talaga siya. Big improvement. Yeah, definitely, there's a big, big improvement. Mm -hmm. Wow. <laughs> so amazing. Walang shiname, guys. Asa wala talaga. So, dagdag lang kami nandito. And it's just Much better than the Hindi pa final. Ano yan, ha? Nice. Alright. This All right. is like, ano muna tayo? Test it first. Oh, Doc, I have a request. Kasi a lot of my followers were asking, like, mm. regarding their, their mga dental problems. Mm. You know? But sure. I know you're a busy guy, and I know you're in a hurry. You wanna sit there? Somebody? Yeah. Maybe 10 questions or no, no, no. All right. Woo, cool, guys. So, so pinagbigyan tayo ni Doc ng sagutin lahat ng mga dental questions niya. Uh, like, mga issues niya. So, sure. let's go. Okay, guys. So, now, we're here with Doc Sunny, my dentist here yeah. at Dental Studio. And pinagbigyan ko kayo sa stories ko na mag-ask kayo ng mga dental problems niyo if meron kayo. Like, mga hindi lang natatanong sa mga dentist nila. Like, sabi ko, okay. And then, madami kong na-receive. So, Kumuha ko ng konti lang, konti lang. Okay, first question daw. <laughs> Bakit po kailangan pumunta sa dentist regularly? Ang gastos po kasi. Ang gastos. Yeah. But uh, para rin yung kotse. Mm -hmm. You just drive and drive, what's gonna happen in your car? Good point. Good point. Good point. So, same goes with our teeth. We eat, we chew, we drink every day, 24-7. Even though you sleep, you still, you might grind, you might talk, so mayroong movement pa rin. So, you have to have it checked. Oh, kasi makila investment din kasi talaga kasi guys iba talaga yung dating pag maganda yung ipin mo right. so kailangan din talaga ng invest kasi kahit magastos invest nang talaga yes. so second question dapat ba mag floss every day di ba ba enough ang brushing not enough kasi ang floss it can go in between the teeth kahit anong toothbrush ipasok mo sa or brush it your teeth are like neighbors magkatit bahay at mayroon din food that will get stuck mm -hmm. in between so flossing is still the best way to remove debris in between your teeth. That's a bit of every afternoon. What they say is at least once a day. Yeah. The time you go... It's so not every night. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah. if you cannot floss during in between meals, you can rinse. Nice. But go to the red bathroom, just rinse. At least Parang hindi mas stock. Uh, stock. And safe po ba yung mga whitening products na binibenta online? Like, kasi may mga powder, di ba? Like mga yeah. brush lang, just may mga charcoal, charcoal. Just ba? be careful kasi, of course, there are what they call in-office whitening or in-clinic whitening. Mayroon Ayun din, in-clinic is we prescribe, mm -hmm. kami nagbibigay ah, okay. ng prescription. Mayroon din tinatawag na over-the-counter. But make sure check niyo yung nakasulat. Kasi mga over-the-counter, milder type of white. Hindi din ba yung mga crest na mga toothpaste? Yes, ganun. gagamit niyan. Yes, from, like, say, from local or from the US. Or mm -hmm. yung toothpaste natin may whitening. They're effective. But then again, they're very mild type of whitening. Maga, they can only remove yung mga, mga nasa labas. Uh, yung mga stain, natatanggal yan. Yes. Kailangan po ba talaga bawasan ang ipin pag nagpapabinir? Uh, depends. If you look at on, on the screen, nasa background nyo, <laughs> yeah. meron talaga kaming veneers na dapat bawasan. bawasan ng konti. At the minimum, at the maximum of around 0.7 mm. Meron din hindi, depending on the case. Then, matatanggal pa ba yung mga white stains? I do have, uh, I have white stains. Yes, and white stains. Ano yung mga causes? Uh, Maraming sure different yun. causes. May white stain because of light, uh, lot of fluoride na intake. They call it fluorosis. Pero medyo maganda yun. Kasi medyo matigas yung matiba yung ipin. Kaya lang, ang pangit lang doon, may mga white spots. May mga white spots din na talagang hindi, malambot. May kontang tawag doon, medyo na, mahina yung enamel niya. So, kailang pastahan. May way ba magtanggal nun? There's a, there's a new material that they can use now and pwedeng mabawasan. Not totally ma-eradicate. Ma Pwede ma mabawasan. Yeah. Ang dami pong tinuturo na proper way to brush your teeth. Yeah. Alin po ba yung totoo? Ah, uh, <laughs> napakilang sa akin. Uh, the best way pa rin is you go from the up and, well, it's up and down and round, round um, circular type of motion. 
And the, the thing is, mature religiously, you have to brush it uh, gently. Gently, at the same time, towards the gums. Ang tinatanggal mo yung dumi, towards the gums. Ah, okay. So, up and then down, round, and then towards the gums. Mukhang wala yata yung tinuturo ko. Matagal dapat, you need to give it some time when you brush it. Kasi uh, siyempre, mapipil mo naman kung may natitira pang dumi. And wag siguro lick harsh, di ba dok? Don't Kasi, like brush it too hard. Yeah. Yes. Don't use soft bristles to brush it. Are veneers applicable to everyone? Why is it expensive? Ah, okay. So, naging very, ano, uh, naging parang inting ang veneers na really. True, <laughs> that's true. Kaya lang hindi naman dapat lahat. Because as of now, we don't want really to cut natural tooth. Yeah. 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 Like before I, I want like para maging perfect teeth again. Then uh, I veneer sa mga ganyan ganyan. Gusto ko mag veneer pero sabi niya hindi. Na. Even as a cosmetic dentist, we don't don't really recommend right away. There are a lot of ways of moving your teeth to make it beautiful. Like for example, if you look at yeah. on the screen there. There's the now a new thing that you can move your teeth. You see that one, the chief? Meron din yung ginawa kong parang composite build up lang. It's yes. like veneer pero Hindi invasive. Basta wag niyo pa shape talaga yeah. guys. And kailangan yung, yeah. yung di ba yung mga mock mock pa daw. Mock up ang yeah. So yung nakikita mo din sa screen at sa background mo. That's a mock up. Yan na. That's a mock up already. Like hindi niyo agad i-shape. Papashave yung mga agad. Kasi plan it very well with the dentist. Yeah. And everyone po ba dapat magpapachange ng pasta? Do, pasta ba talaga itawag niya? Oh, restorations. Restoration. In okay. Tagalog lang kasi we use the word pasta. But of course, don't talk to the French or Italian. Magkain French or Italian. Mga iba yung bilis sa'yo. Nasanay lang tayo sa pasta. But in 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 layman term, ang tawag natin sa English is restoration. Restoration. Okay. So, kailangan ba kailangan mag-restore ng takong nangipin natin? Normally, yung mga white restorations, or we call it composite, mm -hmm. can stay there for four, let's not say four, five to eight years. But then again, standard is to change it every five to eight years. Kung may mga cracks na, it doesn't mean you have to remove the whole thing. Kung may mga chip of crack area, repairable kasi yan eh. You can re-restore those areas, but then again, you have to check it, have it x-rayed, and make sure Oh yeah, the oh. X-ray is super galing na X-ray. Makita talaga guys, like kung pag sa restoration yung behind it kung sila na ba, or may yeah. meron ng mga cavities behind it para kailangan i-change siya, ganun nila. Ay, may follow-up question ako dun sa veneers to. Paano mo malalaman if low quality yung niya? Like, so, pero, like, mahal yan. Yeah. Uh, uh, there are different types of veneer materials. The word lang is veneer is the terminology of our procedure mm -hmm. as dentist. Nang sana yun lang natin sinabing veneer na yeah, yeah, yeah. But the materials is the key, is the, is the reason why it's expensive. And of course, the one who's planning it. Kasi hindi naman lang patong ka lang tapos na yung veneer. Uh -huh. The design is uh, the biggest the challenge. So dapat uh, ang last We are planning, uh -oh. we have to plan it in a way na parang maganda yung result at the same time, long lasting. Hindi yung parang ginawa ko ng veneer, in five years time may nag-chip off na, may doon na nag-stain. You want something that can last you 10, 15 years or more. Shoot them in my opinion. Parang compare mo na lang about your shoes. Cheaper shoes or more expensive shoes. Which one is stronger? You know, my send about the brand. Invest ka lang talaga. Really invest. And of course, the dentist itself. Ganun pa ka linis pag trabaho yung dentist. That's the point. Kaya dito na kayo sa dental studio, guys. <laughs> so, sabi ng doctor ko, bunutin daw, da, daw agad mga sumakit ng ngipin. Totoo ba yun? Ang dami uh, kasi ngipin na masakit saan, baka daw mo ang yeah, ngipin. The, those, those, those years are gone. Kung baga yung mga typical mga... Pag masakit na... Uh, 40 years ago. I will always say, 40 years ago na yan. 20 years ago, nobody wants to, to extract the crown eventually. As much as you can preserve the tooth, pwede mo pa i-save, save it. There are a lot of ways to save the tooth. Masakit na, natamaan na yung nerve, or we call it pulp tissue, pwede mo pa gawin yung root canal treatment. Ah, yeah. The Para mo save mo yung ipin. Yeah. Pwede mo i-pastahan, or restoration, yes, or pwede you can still put crowns. Okay? Crowns means yung, yung porcelain crown. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah, like yeah, 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 yeah. Pwede yan. So, huwag niyo pabunutin yung ipin right away. Kasi sayang, sayang pa rin. Sayang Remember, you are only you have only two sets of teeth in your entire life. One is your teeth when you're young, and you stay up to 12 years old. Uh -huh. And then the rest is the rest is unto you. Wala na. So kung matatanggalin, hindi na yung tutubo. Wala na tutubo. May repair pa ba yung mga cracked tooth? Oh, yes. Uh, 
cost din cost din bayan ng bank, right? Um, crack teeth means dependent. The crack can be cause of may may infection ng ipin, uh -huh. which is we call it dental caries. Kung baga na affected yung ipin na nagkaroon ka ng butas because of bacteria, uh -huh. pwede mag-crack yung ipin. So, how do you know my crack? May repairable ba yun? Repairable, like yung sinasabi ko sa'yo, uh -huh. we can restore. The word now is restore. We can restore kahit lumiit na yan, there are lots of ways of restoring it. Parang we can use white restoration, we can use crowns, we can use... Now, even Denise is part of restoration. So, oh, but yes, it is. May patient... Parang cover up lang? Ganun. Akala mo lang cover up. So, pasok yung ngipin niya, may crack. We can still do a veneer on top. Hindi namin buubus yung ngipin. Veneer pa rin tawag namin doon. So, akala lang ng iba, pampaganda ng si Denise. Hindi. So, there's a lot of things you need to know. Visit your dentist. That's they will true. explain that to you. Disclaimer na lang. Visit na kayo sa mga nearest dentist niyo. Yes. Okay, so that's all, Doc. Thank you so much. Okay. Doc. Thank you so much. Most welcome. Most welcome. Okay, guys. So, nasagot yung mga questions. <laughs> and we are done here. So, let's just thank Doc Yana. Hey, thank you, Doc. Thank you. Alright, guys. So, we are done. Well, hindi pa tapos yung ngipin ko. Pero, tapos na ako for my appointment today. Guys, nag-improve like, talaga yung ngipin ka. See? Thank you guys so much for watching this vlog and I miss it and I'll try my best to be consistent this time. This year, it's gonna be vlog, vlog, vlog always. So guys, thank you so much for watching and if you like this video, give it a thumbs up and if you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe now and don't forget to leave some comments guys. If you have any suggestions that you want to do in this vlog, I'm going to be able Just let me know. Comment down below and that's it. Have a good day guys and thank you so much again for watching.